Hello, my sweet friends. Welcome back to Flow, your 30-day yoga journey. It's an honor and a pleasure to be on this ride with you. It is day 24. Can you believe it? Create. Let's get started. Alrighty, let's begin lying down. Come on down to the ground. Good job, Benji. Wonderful. Bend those knees, bring the soles of the feet to the mat and allow your head to rest. Palms come to the earth. Take a deep breath in. And exhale to relax the shoulders. Toes pointing forward, walk the heels in line with the hips. Take a deep breath in and exhale, just landing here in the moment. On your next inhale, take a deep breath in. Then on your exhale, slowly start to peel up from the tailbone, one vertebra at a time, massaging the spine as you slowly lift the hip points all the way up. Shins forward, chest lifts to the chin, chin lifts to the sky. Take a deep breath in and exhale, soften through the sternum and slowly melt it down. One vertebra at a time, slowing it down again, inhale in. Exhale, tailbone slowly lifts, and sacrum, low back, mid back, upper back, hip points lift, take a deep breath in. Exhale, soften through the sternum, slowly melting it down, one vertebra at a time. One more time, just like this. Tailbone lifts. Slowly we lift up. And then slowly we lower down, sternum softens, mid back, low back, and then the tailbone. All right, now we're gonna shift our weight to the left hip and slow and steady, shift your weight to the left foot, left hip, Slow and steady, we're gonna repeat, but we're gonna roll up on the left side. Left side of the spine. So your right hip will be a little bit higher than your left hip. Just play and then lower it down on the left side. And then slowly shifting it over to the right side. Tucking the tailbone and Slowly, you gotta stay focused, slowly rolling it up on the right side of the spine. Pressing into the right foot. Left hip will be higher than the right this time. And then lowering it down. Shift your hips to the left, rolling up on the left side of the spine. Right hip point will be higher than the left. And then follow your breath, take it to the right one last time. Slowly rolling up. Left hip point will be higher. Beautiful, when you're done, go ahead and bring it back to center and let's do one right up the center line once again, starting with the tailbone. Lifting it up, moving, isolating as much as we can, one vertebra at a time. And then the same thing on the way down. Beautiful, walk the feet together now, open the knees wide, bring the hands to the low belly. Inhale, breathe into your hands, nice big balloon breath here. And exhale to let it go. 
Again, inhale, breathe into the belly. Big balloon inflates here. And exhale, draw it in. One more time. Big inhale, fill your balloon. Pause at the top and hold the breath here. Relax the shoulders down. Neck stays long. And then release. Lovely. Interlace the fingertips. Bring them behind the head now. So your elbows and your legs are mirroring each other here. Feel free to extend the thumbs to cradle the neck here if that feels a little more supportive. Soles of the feet press together. We inhale in, exhale, navel draws down, low ribs press down and into the mat so you can lift up through the head, the neck, the chest. Find support in the low back by engaging the abdominals. Inhale in here, lift a little higher. Exhale, stay. And now moving with the breath, inhale, lower half an inch. Exhale, lift. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Now try to keep the neck long the whole time. Each time you lift, you're pressing your low rib cage down into the mat to lift up and engage the abdominal wall. So it's not a huge move, but it's a mighty move, creating strength in the core, cultivating stability around the spine. Think about drawing your low belly in and up and maintaining that throughout the flow with your breath. Use your hands to gently pull the back of the head, creating a little traction there to keep the neck nice and long. You got this, stay with it. Five, three, two, one, and release. Bring the fingertips to the outer edges of the legs. Slowly close the legs together. Knees come together. Press up off the tops of the feet. Slide the hands to the kneecaps and allow yourself to come into a neutral spine here. So the tailbone's going to reach down. Feet are soft. Breathe. Now stirring with the knees. Open them wide, breathe in. Then bring them close to the chest, the shoulders. Hug the low back and then take them forward, around and in. Moving with your breath, feeling this massage in the sacrum. And then taking the circle the other way. And the next time the knees are together, you'll bring the palms to the tops of the shins somewhere. Inhale in, tuck your chin. Exhale, bend your elbows left to right. Slowly peel the nose up toward the knees. Doesn't have to get close, just the intention rounding through the spine. Now draw your navel, your low belly in and breathe. Good, stay relaxed in the neck, relaxed in the skin of the face. Stay here with the right knee. Extend just the left leg out. Wind relieving pose, the official name of this posture. Squeeze and lift, draw the belly down. Then keep it Maintained in the core, keep the the neck relaxed as you bring the left knee in, both knees together. And then slow and steady, soft in the neck as you extend the right leg out. Bend your elbows left to right. All right, right knee comes in, last squeeze here, breathe. 
And then exhale, release. Prepare for bridge once again. Palms and feet come to the ground. We lift the tailbone, lift the hip points up high. And this time, snuggle your shoulder blades underneath your heart. Maybe take a bind, interlacing the fingertips. Inhale in, exhale to release everything, slowly lowering the hips to the mat. You're gonna cross the ankles here, grab the outer edges of the feet, or you can grab your big toes with your index finger, middle finger and thumb, your choice. And slow and steady, we're gonna rock and roll up and down the length of the spine, coming up to a cross-legged seat. Sit up nice and tall here, Sukhasan. And when you're ready, we'll take a gentle twist to the right, left palm to the right knee, right fingertips behind. Draw the low belly in and up. Inhale, lots of love in here. Exhale, gentle twist. Inhale, lift and lengthen. Exhale, twist. Slowly melt it back through center. Inhale, take it to the other side. Exhale, draw the low belly in and up. Moving with your breath. Inhale, ride the wave all the way up through the crown of the head. Exhale, navel draws in. And slowly bring it back to center. We'll come forward onto all fours. Knees underneath the hips, wrists underneath the shoulders, bump the hips to the left, look past your right shoulder, feel that stretch in the left side waist, and then take it to the other side. And again to the left, hands and feet stay where they are, and then to the right. And then back to center. Keep the left foot on the ground, rooted. Send the right toes out long. Inhale in. Exhale, knee to nose. Just the right knee. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, extend. Step the right foot up. Nice low lunge. Walk the left knee back. Draw your navel in and up. Crescent lunge. Sweep the arms forward, up and back. We're sinking deep here, pulling the right hip crease back, finding that length through the side waist, all the way up through the side body. Maybe you take your gaze up. Inhale in here. Exhale slow and steady. Fingertips come back to the earth. Nice. From here, we'll bring it right back to all fours and bump the hips to the right. Send your gaze to the left. Take it through center to the other side. Hands and feet stay in alignment. And one more time to the right. And to the left, draw the low belly in here. Try to maintain that beautiful. Here we go, press the right foot down, left foot extends. Breathe in, exhale, breathe out, knee to nose. <sighs> Inhale, extend. Exhale, gather the muscles of the abdominal wall up and in. Good, inhale, extend. Exhale, gather, lift and squeeze. <sighs> Inhale, extend. Exhale, step it all the way up. Nice low lunge. Walk that right knee back for a deeper stretch. Crescent lunge. Pull the left hip crease back. Sweep the fingertips forward, up and back. Lift your heart. Find extension. Find length. Support. Lifting from the pelvic floor. Inhale in. Exhale. Slow and steady. Bring it back. Come back to all fours. Walk the knees together now, spread the fingertips wide, come into a half plank. So shift your weight so that your shoulders are over your wrists. Draw the shoulders away from the ears as you lengthen here, inhale in. Exhale, lower halfway, bend the elbows, and then press back up. Only two more. Inhale, extend, exhale, lower halfway, and press back up. Last one. 
And then lower all the way to the belly here. We're gonna walk the knees now as wide as the mat. Keep the hands where they are. Squeeze the elbows into the side body so knees are wide, feet are together. Inhale in, exhale slowly, press into the pubic bone and lift up into a cobra here. Little mermaid cobra, it's not gonna be big. And release, forehead kisses the mat. Again, inhale, rise up. Exhale, release. Last one. Inhale. And exhale, release. Beautiful. Walk the knees together. Send the toes out long. We're gonna slow and steady turn onto our left side today. So come onto the right side of your mat. Turn onto your left shoulder, left ear, and roll over onto your back. Happy baby, bend the knees, grab the outer edges of the feet, kick the soles of the feet up towards the sky, breathe into your belly, and find a little improvised movement here. Maybe rocking a little side to side. Maybe you extend one leg and then the other. Maybe you come into a full straddle for a few breaths. Maybe you move the hands to the arches of the feet. Bringing that creativity to the mat always through listening and responding. From happy baby, you might take a twist. You might massage the low back again by hugging the knees. Maybe you wanna take another bridge pose. Maybe windshield wiper the legs a little left to right, finding that internal rotation of the hip socket. And after a couple moments of freestyle, We'll come to rest with the legs extended, arms resting gently at your side. Hmm. And then close your eyes and take a moment to relax, to give yourself permission here to do absolutely nothing, to simply be and observe your energy as it is in this moment. You might part the lips, you might let everything go. Thank you so much for taking this time for yourself today, for self-study, self-inquiry, and mindful movement to cultivate a healthy flow of energy in the body. You are my hero. Hope you have a wonderful rest of the day or evening. Bring the palms together, thumbs to third eye, deep breath in to close this practice. Exhale, lots of love out. See you tomorrow. Namaste.